Vamos a seguir con The Cat Leader. Du, du, du. Vamos a comernos una hamburguesa rica. Vale, comida para gatos. Hamburguesa. Usar. ¿Usar? Cuando haya... A sentarme y comer, por ejemplo. Silla. Usar. Caminar un, un cuarto de libra con queso barato. Instrucciones de cazador, quitar la envoltura y colocar en un horno microondas. Vale, perfecto. No, a ver, ¿cómo? Un segundo, perdón. Eh, horno de 80 guay, 60 segundos. Vale. Era de, era de 800 vatios, así que 60 segundos, un minuto. Muy bien. El pito voy a meterlo. Vale, 60 segundos. Muy bien. Yami, yami. Tengo las barras de estrés y de felicidad ahí, ahí, eh. Estoy a, estoy a punto de entrar en barrena. Vale. Piano, tocar. A lo mejor tendría que haber dejado las ventanas abiertas, ¿verdad? Come inside, my darlings. I've missed you. Ah, se las ha pelado infinito. Teacup. I bet you thought you'd never see me again. Well, make yourselves at home. Dinner is ready to be served. Muy bien. Come on, everybody. Gather around. It's time for dinner. Qué guay, eh, míralos. Son para mis gatos, siempre les dejo comida aquí fuera cuando vienen. You never eat my food, teacup. Already had your dinner, have you? ¿Qué te pasa, teacup? No, I get it. I know. You're a good friend. The best friend I have, really. The only friend in the whole fucking world. You come over to keep me company and want nothing in return. I appreciate it. You should know. If you could know what I've been through lately. I've been to hell and back, my boy. But I'm here now. In my flat. Alive. And it's still the same mess that it's always been. I'm not sure how to deal with all this anymore. Don't know if I can. I wish I could be like you, at peace with the world, mm -hmm. always smiling. Someone's at the door, but who could it be so late at night? Okay. Espera un segundo. Wait. ¿Quién es ese señor? 
Are you out of your mind? Do you know what time it is? We've all had it with you and your bloody cats. What the fuck? En serio, por un poco de piano. I suggest you change your tone right now. Don't tell me about my tone. I'll have any tone I like. If it's all right for you to play the fucking piano in the middle of the night, then I can bloody raise my voice if I want to. You think you own this place? You think any of us here care about your stinking cats? Hijo they de are perra. a bloody nuisance. Pierdete, pero feo, no tengo nada más que decirte. Get lost, you bald, ugly man. I'm done talking to you. What? How dare you? This is going to stop. One way or the other, you crazy cat lady. If this happens again, you'll see pest control stepping in, and it won't be pretty. Hell, I'll poison your fucking cats myself if I have to. Point that finger at me again, and I will break it. I'm done talking to you. Go fuck yourself. Eso, a tomar por culo. I mean. Uy. Entrado en barrena, eh. <risa> no. Pero creo que era pretendido, ¿eh? Creo que funciona así el juego. Pero qué jodido es este juego, ¿no? Este juego es crudísimo. Standing by the river, I'm thinking. Will I jump again? No. Behind the closed doors, I have fallen in love with the razor. Madre mía. Una bala para Susan. Best control. Estoy flipando muchísimo con este juego. Pero estoy flipando lo infinito con este juego.
slept all night and most of the day. Why am I still feeling tired? Someone's at the door. I really hope it's not him again. Esperemos que no, aunque... Hombre, puede que sea el de la peste, ¿no? La rabia está... Me da cuando la gente toca, 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 chic. Te he escuchado, te he escuchado, te he escuchado la, el primer toque. Llegaré cuando llegue, en serio. Hay gente que, en la, que lo hace también en, en la vida real, ¿sabes? Es como... Llegaré cuando llegue. Uh. Hello, Miss Ashworth. How are you? Are you feeling better? Do I know you? Of course. You don't remember me. My name is Mitzi Hunt. We met a few days ago. You were out cold at the time. Those pills you had were real good. Ah, la que dijo que era mi hija. One too many, mind you. Ah. Así que eres tú. Tenía el presentimiento de que, de que aparecerías tarde o temprano. It's you. I had a feeling you'd turn up sooner or later. It is me, indeed. A girl who got in the way and fucked everything up. I'll let her stand if you're angry at me. It wouldn't surprise me if you blame me for calling the ambulance and saving your life, but... I had other reasons for it, too. Hmm. Personal reasons. It's important. It's important. That's why I came here the other night. To talk to you. Hmm. Why would you want to talk to me? It makes no Estoy, sense. Me, mucho mi interés. It seems you have a room to rent. Oh! I, they still print that? It was months ago. Nobody ever called. I forgot all about it. I gave up on it, actually. Well, I'd like to be your lodger, Miss Ashworth. But... You've got oh. the room and I've got the money. Won't that work for both of us? Pues la verdad es que sí. I'm very tidy. I don't make much noise and I promise not to spend too long in the bathroom in the morning. I don't really... I read your suicide note, you know. I'm sorry, but I did. I understand that you like your loneliness. You stray from people. I get it. But I won't get in the way. I promise I will give you your space. You won't even know that I'm here half the time. What do you think? Do we have a deal? Well, I guess I could do with some extra money, mm -hmm. but... Great! Can I come in? No es una mala idea, Tony. Bastante buena idea. ¿Cómo entra hasta aquella noche? Estoy segura de que haber cerrado con llave. How did you get in that night? I'm sure I locked the door. Well. Okay, I'll tell you. You won't like it probably, but I'll tell you. I picked the lock. Ah, muy bien. You did what? Look, I know it sounds like I'm some sort of criminal, but believe me, I'm not. My dad was a master locksmith. He knew everything there was to know about locks. He taught me some of that stuff too. Look, I've got this little box. I always carry it with me. There are a few types <laughs> of things in it. They're very expensive. Custom made. It's now the only thing that reminds me of him. I see. But you know, it does sound like your father was really a burglar, not a locksmith. It's not important anymore. I guess it isn't. But what gave you an idea that you can pick the lock on my front door and just barge in uninvited? I heard the cats. They were going crazy. It was like if all hell broke loose inside. Ah. The noise they made. It was incredible. Like ghosts howling. Los gatos. For a while, it turned into an almost human cry. Ah. 
Well, anyway, I kept banging on the door, but you were already asleep. In a coma or whatever. So I pulled out a sea rake and got the door open. I... You could say I had a hunch. Mm -hmm. A hunch. Great. I had a hunch that something was very wrong. And I made no mistake, did I? No, no, that's good enough. You said you were my daughter at the hospital. You're a little liar, aren't you? <laughs> How can I trust you? How should I know you won't slit my throat when I sleep? Jesus, what's wrong with you? So what is it to you? Hace dos días te ibas a suicidar. If I wanted to do such a thing, I would never have bothered saving you. Claro. Would I? Just think about it for a second. I was trying to avoid all the stupid questions. I didn't know what else to say. That seemed like an easy option at the time. Otherwise, they wouldn't have let me come in the ambulance with you. And I wanted to see if you've made it. Mm. Well, I died in that hospital, if you must know. Oh. But not for long enough. It seems I must have been too attached to this shitty life I lead, and must suffer some more before <laughs> I can rest. Nice. Miss Ashworth, why all this negativity? What in the world has made you think this way? Clearly the only thing you suffer is some nasty depression. Not that it's any of my business. But have you tried talking about it to a doctor? Yes, I have. Did it help? Un poco, sí. ¿Por qué no? You must be out of your mind, Mitzi. It did. Sí. Fue bastante... La verdad es que la movida con el Dr. X fue bastante terapéutica, por decirlo de alguna forma. Sí, la verdad es que empoderó bastante a Susan. This spare room I have is pretty bad, you should know. I'm not fussy. It's not for long anyway. Just a few weeks, maybe. Anything is better than what I've got at the moment. Which is? I slept at the train station last night. Ah, muy bien. There's a guy there who docks rats. You should see him. Wait, can you even afford rent for the room? Sure. I'll pay you for two months in advance. Money's not an issue. Why not go to a hotel then? I hate hotels. More than train stations. With homeless weirdos. And rats. Robbie? Oh no, he's cool. He's alright. <laughs> and he kept the rats away. Why do you want this room so much? Let's face it, this flat's falling apart. It's cold, it's dark, it's a bit moldy. This is the old part of town where nothing ever happens. It's far from the city center, and there are only two buses going through here, and that's if you're lucky. And I'm known around here as a fucked up, wicked cat lady. <laughs> They'd burn me at the stake if they could. They'd put me in a bag, and drown me in the river like a litter of kittens. I'm not exactly great company for a young girl like yourself. Who are they? People. Just people. I don't give a fuck about people, Miss Ashworth. I know. But I do like cats. You think they'll smell the rats on me? I really need a shower. Okay. I'm sure you'll change your mind when you see it. I love to see it, and I'm sure it isn't as bad as you picture it. The window is stuck, and it doesn't shut properly. It's all right. I like fresh air. There's clutter everywhere. I'll tidy up. It's got a funny smell. <laughs> I'll burn some joysticks to cover it up. I love joysticks. Fine. I give up. Give up. Follow me. You can sí. see it for yourself, if you're so stubborn. Es que a veces, ¿sabes? A veces es... Tienes tanta negatividad dentro y de, y de repente te cruzas con alguien a, a quien... ¿Sabes? Todas las cosas que para ti son un universo de, de barreras imposibles que, que no puedes superar porque, porque se amontonan y están haciendo tu vida miserable. De repente llega alguien y dice... Ah, pff, ¿Sabes? Y a veces es necesario tener gente así en tu vida, ¿sabes? Que te ayuda a cambiar un poco la perspectiva de las cosas. Vale, Red Max.
Sí, sí. Bueno, vamos, vamos a. Vamos a. Espera un segundo. Bueno, aunque si me van a, me van a pagar esto ya deja de ser un, un tema, pero bueno. ¿Sigues? This room is perfect. Really. What about all this? ¿Qué pasa, marxista? ¿Cómo estamos? But most of it I can use. All I really need is a bed to sleep and a roof over my head to calm me from that rain. And a power outlet so I can charge my laptop. Oh, and someone to watch too. You got a shower, right? I'm dying for a shower. Mm. <laughs> Eres parte de la subcultura emo. <laughs> Eres angst. Are you a part of that emo subculture? Please don't say that word ever again. <laughs> oh no, this is just how I dress. Mm. I grew up listening to real mm. rock and roll, not that emo crap. Mm. I hate to be a part of that generic bandwagon. Okay, <laughs> clearly a sensitive subject for you. You know, people seem to think that just because someone dresses in black, they're called for emo. You can't generalize like that. It's more complicated. I dress in black too. Of course. That's because black is the best color. Period. Sienta bien. Esa es la verdad. You mentioned some personal reasons for staying here. Yes. It's a long story though. I don't really want to bore you with all that personal crap. Okay. In that case, could you give me the short version? Yeah, all right. I'm looking for someone. I don't really know this person, but it's a friend of a friend. I only ever talk to this guy online, so I don't know what he looks like. Qué misteriosa I love esta this persona, lamp. ¿no? Does it work? What was I talking about? Oh, yes. I don't know what he looks like, but I know my way around computers. I managed to track him down. Turns out he lives here, in this building somewhere. What I don't know is which flat he lives in. There are eight flats here all together. He's in one of them, and I must just figure out which one. It shouldn't be too hard. What do you want from this person? I just want to talk to him. He said something... really bad. Something horrible. I need to talk to him to get closure, you know. Just talk. Are you sure? Yep. I want to meet face to face with him. That's all. Okay. You're not in some kind of trouble, are you? Do I really look like some kind of a serial murderer to you, Miss Ashworth? I don't know. What do serial murderers look like anyway? A scar across the face, an eye patch, rough stubble. Those sort of things, I guess. That's a pirate you've just described. Kill when I just are. add a wooden peg leg and we've got a full picture. But who knows? I'm no expert on murderers. Not yet, anyway. Is there anyone I can contact? For references? Well, I've never really rented a room before, so... Not really. I've lived with my mum all my life. Till recently, that is. I could give her a call. Oh, that would be a perfect spot for my post out there. Oh. Yeah, sh sure, that'd be okay. You know, you've been asking me all these questions and I never had a chance to ask about how you're feeling. I mean, you've just gone through a terrible experience. You barely survived. I suppose I might be out of line to ask you this, but I'm really curious as to why you tried to kill yourself. What made you do that? What did you feel? Hmm. Long story. Won't bore you with this personal crap. <laughs> right back at me, I guess. <laughs> I did give you a short version, though. Yes, but somehow I can't help the feeling that you've omitted a few important facts. Just some details. 
Anyway, I suppose your story is the kind that can't be shortened. Still, if you feel like talking about it sometimes, I'd love to listen. I'll bear that in mind, Mitzi. Let's go back to the living room. Okay. The room's great. So what do you say, Miss Ashworth? Hostia. I hope you're not going to change your mind about this. Miss Ashworth? What happened? Are you alright? Go away! You have to go away right now! But... Why? Miss Ashworth, what's wrong? You're not safe here. You should leave. Now. Please, Miss Ashworth, I'd really like to stay. Don't throw me out now. Well, you can't stay. You can't. If you don't go, something terrible's gonna happen to you. Please, just leave me alone. I was perfectly happy before you came. I have my cats. I have... I... I knew you were one of them. I knew it! What are you talking about? Look, just try to relax. Everything's okay. But why you? Why would you want to do this to me? You have no reason! Calm down. I'm not gonna do anything to you, alright? I just want to rent a room. Nothing else. I promise. Damn, I even swear. I won't cause you any trouble, okay? Just take a deep breath. Please explain to me what's happened. I'm a little confused here. Then... Maybe... Oh, no. No. I know. Yeah. I know. But how did you know, Miss Ashworth? Are you some sort of a psychic? Do you possess some kind of supernatural mind treating abilities? Or is it just so fucking obvious? What do you mean? I... I don't know how you're going to die, but call it a hunch, if you like. That's cool. A hunch. Well, I do. I know exactly. Mm -hmm. It's already started, as a matter of fact. Do you want to see? I'll show you. Here, Miss Ashworth. Take a good look, because I'm not going to do it again. I'm fed. Hostia, este juego es súper oscuro y duro, ¿eh? Pero súper oscuro y súper duro. It's time to wake up, my little pussy cat. What's the matter, sleepyhead? Had a bad dream? Uh, do you want me to give you a cuddle and a kiss? Take the nightmares away? What's the matter? Cat got your tongue? <laughs> well, don't you worry, my sweetest. I know a thing or two about pussy cats. I can help. What do you say? Shall I take a good look at this pussy of yours? What the fuck? You're a dead man. You just don't know it yet. I'll cut your throat open and watch you bleed to death. I'll feed your body to the crows. 
Oh, you're gonna regret this, pal. What's going on in there? Who is this? Did you play with this little bitch behind my back? Cause if you did, I swear to God. Me? I'd never do that. You know me, honey. You're the only girl for me. This lady here will join us for dinner. That's all. For what? Take the goddamn mask off when you talk to me. You know damn well I can't stand it. And make sure you put it back in the van so you don't fucking lose it again. Okay, okay. I was just saying, uh, she, she's here for dinner. Good. Dinner. I'm starving. And I'm sick to death of them bloody cats! You nasty little whore! Trying to seduce my husband in my own home? How bloody rude! Get away from me! Shut up, you stupid bitch! I know what you're up to. You kept staring at him with these big green eyes. You want him, don't you? You think you can take him from me? The fuck? Well, I've got just the thing. I always keep this bottle handy. It's bleach. The strongest you can get. You give me no choice. I can't risk losing him. I have to make sure he won't be attracted to you anymore. You won't need these eyes and this face much longer anyway. Que simpática. Que tocho. No one will do it right if you don't do it yourself. Oh, manejamos al gato ahora. <risa> nice. Bueno, pues eh, lo vamos a dejar por aquí. A ver un segundito. Eh, guardar. Guardar. Mal rollo. Cinco. Muy bien. Espero que os esté gustando, malditas sea. Está de puta madre el juego. Está muy bien, ¿eh? Muy bien.